Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Friday the 25th of February and today is a really exciting day because I am finally going to see Les Mis for the first time ever. I have never seen Les Mis and I have purposefully avoided seeing the film because I wanted the first, like I wanted my first experience with Les Mis to be on stage and the day has finally come. Um, Les Mis is one of those productions that I have always wanted to see but for various reasons have not been able to see until today. Um, I wanted to make sure that when I saw it I had a really good seat, I was in a really good headspace um, and I'm sitting second row centre stage so I'm really 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 excited. I think I'm more excited as well because I've become more familiar with the soundtrack because we're doing a Les Mis medley in my musical theatre course. So I've become quite familiar with various, I mean like there are so many songs, but like a, like a few songs I've, I've come to know quite well. Um, but yeah, I'm just, I'm so excited. I cannot wait. I am going to wear waterproof mascara because I have a feeling that I'm going to get really, really emotional. I mean, it is a really, really sad show like everyone dies <laughs> but um yeah I can't wait I I just want it to be like the evening so that I can go um but yeah I have lots to do today I am caffeinating um and I had a meeting this morning um and I have a bunch of stuff that I need to crack on with I also have to start practicing my solo um so I'm gonna sing on my own from Limmers in two weeks in front of my theatre group. Um, I'm quite nervous, but I'm not as nervous as I was prior to my first singing lesson, like my first private singing lesson. So I have the house to myself this morning, so I'm just gonna practice some of the belty parts um, and we'll see how that goes. Um, but I will update you throughout the day and take you with me to the Sondheim Theatre to see interesting um to show you guys this but for those of you that don't know for two just over two years I ran operations at impact school and um one of the things that allowed me to do that job and do it well is my obsession with organization um and I have recently revamped my calendar thanks to Cassidy um who sent me someone on I, th I think it was like a website or something um where they kind of showed you how to make your calendar just look more aesthetic and um just function a little bit better so I'm going to show you because every time I open my calendar now I I'm just so happy um and this really helps me like I think I work I don't think I know I work a lot better when things are like super super organized I really like time blocking as well like that really really helps me I know that some people don't um but I really enjoy that and it really helps me so I'll show you so this is my calendar and as you can see over here I have um like different categories so like invites that I get on my gmail like for events and stuff um holidays in the UK birthdays impact school movement work Theatre, socialising, meals, meetings, deadlines, routine, travels, admin, musical theatre, YouTube, etc. It's essentially what it looks like and it's all colour coded and like really beautiful and it syncs with my phone. <laughs>
intermission and the first act, I didn't know that I was going to get this emotional but when the music started they're like da 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 da, I just started crying, like that was it and I cried for most of the first act and the second act I'm told is when the majority of people really really cry so I don't know what's in store. Um, everyone is incredible, the music is ridiculous and it's such a sad and like emotional show. I feel like I'm gonna start crying. <laughs> but I'm really enjoying it, it's really really good. I'm so happy to finally be here. It's been like a long time coming, but I will check in after the show. That was, I have no words, um, that was an insane experience, I don't think I have ever been as moved with music, like the music alone, I mean the show is just so sad and like when Jean Valjean dies at the end I was like why does he have to die? But the music alone was just, it was so beautiful. And I was really close to the front and I could see the conductor and he was so animated. And I think that just made it more emotional for me. I have to rejig my top five musicals now. That was the most, one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. And I will definitely be going back 
again and again and again and I can't wait to see it again. Um, I need to put myself together because there are lots of people around but yeah I think I'm gonna end it here. Um, thank you for watching if you have stayed this far and I will catch you next time.